Hello, this is Steve from Colorado Wholesale Dye. We're making this video in January of 2013. We've had people request that they get a better idea of what some of our colors look like. Um, I tell you the date we made this video because the dye business is remarkably inconsistent over time on what colors look like and uh, uh, the formulations of colors and that's not just with our company that would be with any dye company uh, seems like there's a lot of inconsistency in raw materials in the dye business but uh, this is what our colors all these uh, swatches were dyed within the last month or so they're all dyed on just regular cotton sheeting and there's no real formulation to how we dyed these samples we just dyed them uh, kind of just to strong bright colors like we'd use on tie-dye so uh, bear in mind that all dye colors can be used as you like them either mix strong or weak if you want nice pastel shades you can take reds and make them into pinks by mixing them really weak or or making them strong and getting red colors things like that that goes with all the colors uh, you can make them strong or weak or a medium shade depending on the depth of shade you want. So I'm going to zoom in and go through each color uh, so you can kind of see what uh, these swatches look like. I'll just start the top and kind of pan through all the colors. and they just go in numerical order they're laid out uh, our, our colors have numbers to them like mixing red number six and then deep rose red number seven so they're just gonna go uh, in order six seven eight nine like that so that's mixing red six and I'll just pan through them without really talking I can already tell looking through this lens that these colors aren't really true to form even on this video screen. For example, in real life that orange is super bright and kind of pops out. And that next color, gold, is <laughs> very much a gold color. In this screen that I'm looking at it almost looks like a salmon color. So even this doesn't really tell you very well, especially these yellows do not look really at all that banana yellow is pretty much a bright gold color looks very flat on this screen it's not a flat color like that at all uh, that lemon yellow seems to be a bright, lot brighter in person but that's at least kind of the flavor of what it looks like and then some of these colors you can't on this screen that forest green looks navy blue when really in real life it's a it's a definitely a green color so I'm not sure how, how well this will work, but at least this is another representation. That's kind of a problem with computers and cameras and screens is they don't get the colors exactly perfectly. Like, like looking at that bright green, in live that bright green really pops out. It's a very strong bright color. On this screen it looks kind of dull. Okay, now I'll go down to the next row. And that crayon green, it's very hard to tell it's even green on this screen, but, but it is. And the sea green has a, a lot more green tones to it. It looks like a light turquoise on this screen. And on these screens too, you can barely tell a difference between cerulean blue and royal blue, but there is a difference, and even baby blue.
So hope that helps. There's another representation of what some of the colors look like on a video camera. I wish they were a little truer to form, but that that's our color chart.